Hi, how are you? Matt Watson here from CarWow. So I'm sat in a BMW M5 CS and next to me is a Porsche Panamera Turbo S. And we're gonna have a drag race to find out which is the quickest over the standing quarter mile. And if you like these kind of drag races, make sure you subscribe to this channel and hit the bell icon to turn your notifications on. That way you won't miss a single upload. Now let me tell you about this BMW. So it has a 4.4 litre twin turbo V8 that puts out 635 horsepower and 750 newton meters of torque. It drives all four wheels via an eight-speed torque converter automatic gearbox so it does have launch control. Being the CS, BMW has removed weight from the normal M5 competition and as a result it weighs in at 1,825 kilos. Though all that weight saving which involves a carbon bonnet and loads of other bits and pieces comes at quite a cost. 140 thousand pounds anyway rather than me tell you about the porsche panamera turbo s i'm going to let its driver who's the new presenter on the german car wow youtube channel his name's daniel let's meet him hey daniel you all right i am tell me about that porsche so it's a four liter bi turbo v8 it has 630 horsepower and it has 820 newton meters of torque 2080 kilograms heavy though i might be at a disadvantage in terms of weight yeah so you've got slightly less horsepower a bit more torque and a lot more weight but it's a porsche and porsches can just launch so well this car can launch well sometimes it doesn't launch so well so we'll see how it plays out do you know the price of your car well i know the euro price which is slightly more than the bmw is 192,000 euros yours is about 10,000 cheaper it's about 140 in the uk anyway that's enough of that nonsense if you're german you're watching this and you'd like to see more stuff from daniel in german then click on the pop out banner up there for the link in the description below to go check out the german car wow youtube channel right loads of special reviews and videos especially for the Germans, because they like things a little bit more serious. Right, let's go on with this. Buy, sell, car, wow. Now, before we race, we're going to do the customary car wire sound check. So I'm going to rev up this BMW. Mm -hmm. Soft limiter. Okay, I've got a soft limiter at four and a half. Let's see what you've got there, Daniel. I thought you were saying a little bit more fruity. Yes, a soft limiter, but some pops and bangsy bits on the exhaust. Yes, it did. <laughs> He's a man of many words. Anyhow, before we go any further, I need to say to you, if you're thinking about selling your car and you want to see how much it's really worth, click on the pop-out banner up there for the link in the description below to get a car wipe. Just upload some photos, brief description, and our dealers will bid on your car. You can see how much it's worth. And if you want to, you can sell the car to one of the dealers, obviously the one with offers you the highest price. If you want to do that later today, just simply Google Help Me Car Wow and we will help you change your car, buy a new one or silly current one. Now let's finally race. Three, two, one. Ah, I have the start for pass. Smashed them off the line, but picked it back up a bit. Come on, BMW. This faltered a bit on a change of gear, lost a bit of traction. I had to go off the line, but there really wasn't much in it after that, was there? It was slow off the line, and after that, it could have been like both the cars finishing the same time. I think we need to do it again. I agree, for science. <laughs> and for fun as well. Three, two, one. Oh, he had me off the line that time. Come on, BMW. It's come to BMW. Reeling him in a little bit now. But no, bugger. I bet you're pretty happy with that, aren't you? Yeah, I'm not sure if I jumped the start or if I just have amazing reactions. Let's find out. Stuart, did the Porsche jump the start? The Porsche did not jump the start. Damn. Best two out of three, Daniel. It's got to be, hasn't it? Yep, let's do it. It's so close! Oh, man, the BMW just has the edge! Woo! That 
That was insane. Daniel, we could not have got a closer launch than that. That was perfect. And for a while it looked like there was nothing in it, but then you pulled away somehow. That was due to my superior driving skill, obviously. Ich denke, die Autos sind wirklich nahezu identisch. Es hängt wirklich davon ab und wie viel man das Lenkrad bewegt. Anyway, let's do it. So then what exactly happened? Well, the BMW won, completing the standing quarter mile in 11 seconds, while the Porsche took 11.1 seconds. Sorry to interrupt the video, but I need to tell you about the CarWow September sale. We've got over 800 amazing deals with an average saving of £1,500. So click on the pop-out banner up there or the link in the description below to go to CarWow to check out the sale. But move quickly because the offers end on the 30th of September. Now we're going to have a rolling race from 50 miles an hour. Cars in their comfiest setting, automatic mode from the gearbox. I'm going to count it in. Three, two, one, go. Change. Porsche just beat me on the gear change, but here comes a half mile. Can I just ease ahead of him? BMW is just a fraction quicker, isn't it? Yeah, I think you changed gears a little bit. Well, you got it. it changed gears a bit quicker than this one, and it looked like you were going to beat me for a short period, anyway. I think we saw the, the advantage of the double clutch for a little bit and then we didn't see it anymore. We saw the disadvantage of slightly less horsepower, not by much, but a bit more weight, I'd say. Yeah, I agree. And a little bit less driver's skill from you compared to me as well. Yes, very true. He's just playing along, isn't he? Right, now we're going to have another rolling race from 50 miles an hour, but this time the cars are in their sportier setting and manual mode for the gearbox. Roll on from third. Three, two, one, go. He's absolutely getting hammered now. Yeah, sorry, Matt, I missed the gear change there again. I was wondering that. I was thinking, what's wrong with that Porsche? Let's do it again. Three, two, one, go. This BMW is just quicker, isn't it? Especially rolling, it is, yes. Can it win one more challenge? Let's find out. Finally, then, we're going to do a brake test from 100 miles an hour. Which car will stop in the shortest distance? When we reach the line, full emergency stop. If you'd rather watch another drag race, click up there or follow the link in the description. If you don't, here comes the brake test. Right, surprised at that. I didn't think it would be this much of a difference, but I suppose weight matters, doesn't it? I was hoping for the excellence of the Porsche brakes, but yeah, this is weight. There you go. Now, if you're thinking about buying a performance car, but you haven't quite got enough money to buy one of these really expensive things, I found a great deal on a car that's great fun to drive, got lots of performance through CarWow. If you want to find out what the car is in the deal, click on the pop-out banner up there for the link in the description below. Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a like. Let me know which of these two cars you'd rather have by voting in the pinned comment below. Click on those windows there for some more videos. And if you click on that box there, you can find out how much your car is really worth through CarWow. The service is completely free.